Hey guys, what's up? It's Jeff from Wonder Dog Sports. We got 10 weeks of the NFL season in the books. On to week 11. Last week's video pick won again, moving us to eight and one on the season on such picks. I'll have another one as always here at the end of this video. It was also a winning week for us overall in the NFL, the 10th winning week out of 15 thus far, which includes the preseason. Let's get right into this week's betting system. I know that a lot of people really like to bet for points and scoring. It's more fun to root for, but be careful if you're looking at betting the over in week 11. Over the past 25 NFL seasons, the under in week 11 is 211 and 176. That's 55% for all games. If we throw out the low total games and focus only on those with a total of 44 or higher, the results jump to 70 and 42 to the under. This week there are 10 such games. Okay, on to my week 11 NFL video pick, going for nine and one. This week, I'm looking at the Tampa Bay-Kansas City game, specifically the total. This is one of those 10 games. Kansas City's been a big surprise at seven and two to start the season. Big win last week. What may not be such a surprise though is their five game winning streak. The Chiefs have been the NFL's streakiest team over the last four years, putting together at least a five game winning streak now in four consecutive seasons. One hallmark of the Chiefs winning streaks these four years has been defense, and it's no different this season, as they've allowed just 76 points in those five games. That's 15.2 points per game. Hard to beat them when, when they're putting up that kind of defensive effort. Not a single team is top 21 on this defense. The offense on the other story is, uh, has been a problem. It's not topped the 20 point mark in the last two wins. Uh, let's face it, Alex Smith is safe but uninspiring. Tampa Bay comes into this game off a 36 point performance versus the Bears, but a lot of that had to do with poor defense and four Chicago turnovers. The Chiefs haven't turned the ball over, excuse me, they turned the ball over just once in the last five games, so they really shouldn't be handing the Bucks many gifts here. Tampa Bay averages just 5.3 yards per play versus the schedule of teams that allow on average 5.6, so they're really underperforming. The Chiefs are 16 and six to the under the last three years when facing a good passing team, and they're 41 and 22 to the under when coming off three consecutive wins. Since the arrival of Andy Reid, they're 35 and 24 to the under, including 18 and nine under at Arrowhead. Take the under in this game. Remember, you can bet this game and any other game for free at sportsplays.com. Good luck to you this week.